Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with another Trader Joe's haul. And this haul is mainly a few dinner things and snack things and just things that would be easy to fix on like a weeknight if we don't want to cook and stuff. But if you haven't watched the other Trader Joe's haul that I've done, usually from Trader Joe's we get like snack things and a few dinner items and then Walmart pickup we get a lot of our basics and like our laundry detergent and things like that. And then we also go to the produce stand. So I do go to three different grocery stores, not every single week, but just whenever we need need stuff but yeah this is quite a big Trader Joe's haul because there's a few things that I haven't tried before that I've seen that I wanted to try and there's some things that we buy every single time we go so I'll kind of go through it and let you guys know like what are repurchases and what aren't and like I said there's a lot of stuff so we'll just go ahead and jump right into it all right, so to start off, I got the Everything Shibata Rolls, and so many people have raved about these. Even the guy that checked me out was saying that he's been buying like two bags of these a week. So I'm really excited to try these. I really want to get a ham and fix it in the crock pot and throw that ham, because I do like brown sugar and pineapple and stuff on this. I think it would be awesome. But I bought that. I have the yellow lentil brown rice pasta. My husband does prefer this over like regular pasta for spaghetti and stuff. I prefer it as well but i just didn't know how he would like it when i fixed it the first time but he loved it so i wanted to go ahead and pick up two of these because they don't always have this in stock and then over here i have the tikka vegetables and i don't even know how you say that so i'm not gonna butcher it but basically what these are are just like sauce packs for things so this has vegetables spices and creamy tomato sauce and in this one it has vegetables um cheese and spices and cashews so literally what we do for this is we just use it for a quick weeknight dinner i'll cook some white rice and some chicken and then we'll throw this in there and just kind of make like a bowl out of it so yeah we really love this stuff we have literally been through like seven of these and like three of these they're both so good and then I bought these little brioche toasts and I bought these because I went ahead and picked this guy up. This is the bruschetta that Trader Joe's sells and so many people have raved about this so I really wanted to try it but I didn't know what we would put it on that we had at the house already so I went ahead and bought these to put it on. I have to let you guys know what we think about it because we haven't tried these or the bruschetta yet. Then I got a box of the organic shells and white cheddar macaroni and cheese. I've tried the regular macaroni and cheese but I haven't tried this one yet so I went ahead and picked this one up. I love mac and cheese so hopefully this is good. So I got one box of this and then the last thing for dinner items is this roasted garlic marinara. We love this stuff for spaghetti or just any kind of pasta. I prefer this pasta sauce over any other pasta sauce that I've tried to be honest. So I went ahead and bought one of those. I think we already have one but I want to do a couple of pasta dishes over the next couple of weeks so I went ahead and got another one. So now we're on to snacks and I do eat a lot of snacks throughout the day at work. I just always have to have something with me because I get hungry. So I buy a lot of snacks as you can see. But I got some of the inner peas. This is just crunchy baked green pea snacks. I wanted to try this kind. I've tried the kind that they sell at like Kroger and Walmart and stuff. But I just wanted to try this. They had a lot of new snacks like the baked peas and different things like that in our store. So I wanted to go ahead and pick this up to try. I got some dried pineapple rings. I will not eat regular pineapple, but I love dried pineapple rings. I'm really weird. I don't know what it is. But I got that and I also got some sweet apple rings, which is new for me. I've never gotten these before. I love apples, but I just usually stick with my mango and my dried pineapple. But I wanted to try these this time. They looked really good, so we got that. And then I got two bags of the Just Mango Slices, which is just dried mango. Dried mango is so good. If you want something sweet and you like gummy candies, but you want something a little bit more healthy, get this stuff. It's obviously not going to be like super sugary and like gummy candy, but it's the next best thing. So I love that. I usually go through one bag quick, so I just went ahead and bought two of them. I got the soft strawberry licorice twist. I love these things. And as you can see, after I went shopping last night, I already broke into this one. 
So I went ahead and grabbed two of those. We got a bag of oranges. Usually I would just wait and get those at the produce stand, but we were not gonna be able to make it in time. And my husband eats oranges with his lunches and we only had one more and he usually eats two. So I went ahead and picked up a bag of oranges. And then I have the organic toasted coconut granola. This sounds freaking amazing. I have vanilla almond milk yogurt that I eat for lunch. And I think I have the peanut butter granola right now, but I wanted to try something new. So I picked this up. This looks so good. My sister wants to try this as well. I also have the Coffee Lovers Espresso Beans. If you haven't tried these and you love coffee, you need to. I've almost finished one bag off, so I went ahead and picked this up. I have some of the Peel Away Fruit Leather Buttons. This is just like little fruit buttons. I have two of the grape mango, two of the strawberry mango, and two of the regular mango. And then along with that, I always get these little bars right here. They're just little dried fruit bars. They come with two strips each in them. I usually get several of each just because I put them in my lunch, eat them with my breakfast, things like that. So we have the apple apricot, we have the apple raspberry, and then the, what is this one? the apple strawberry so i have four of those four of those and five of these and then we're on to like snacky things and like freezer things so the first thing that i have is the chicken fried rice we always keep this as well as the mandarin orange chicken in the freezer just in case we ever want to have like a really quick weeknight meal if neither one of us feels like cooking so we have that in the freezer literally at all times i bought the mac and cheese bites because i've never tried these but apparently they are bomb so i have those and i'll probably try them sometime today i'm dying to try these and then I bought the mini chicken tacos. We eat these for lunch. We eat these for a snack. Sometimes we'll just throw them in for dinner and have it with like a side of queso and salsa and chips. We literally go through these so, so quick. It's mostly me, but my husband likes them as well. And then we have the reduced guilt mac and cheese, which I love. And then I have the Reduced Guilt Baked Ziti. I had never tried this before, but as you can see, the box is like empty because I ate it last night. But this was actually really super good. It wasn't anything like different from any other baked ziti. Um, it didn't have enough cheese on it for my liking, so I just put a little bit more cheese on the top of it and let it melt. But it is really good, and I will repurchase this in the future. And then I got us a spinach and artichoke dip. We actually really love this. It's so hard to find a spinach and artichoke dip that's frozen that's actually good, but this one is actually really good, so I bought that. We've been through two of these already. And then the last thing that I got was this mango tangerine candle. This is a scented candle that is made with coconut and soy wax. I've been trying to buy candles that are better for us, like natural fragrances, soy based, coconut based, whatever. So I really wanted to try this because I'd never tried a candle from Trader Joe's before, but I love this. I burned a little bit of it last night. It smells so good. I'll probably go back for a couple more of these and every time they come out with a new scent, I will go get it because it's awesome. And it was only like $3.99. So if you haven't tried their candles yet, but you've been kind of eyeballing it, go now. They're so good. All right, guys, that is it for this week's Trader Joe's haul. I usually go to Trader Joe's like every three weeks or so because we don't go through all of this quickly. I usually just go when we need a little bit of everything. But anyway, this is what I got this time. If you have any recommendations for things that you love from Trader Joe's, let me know down below. I love trying new stuff from there. And let me know what other videos like this you would like to see. And don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video.